Hey everyone, in this video we are going to talk about how to convert a measure of an angle in degrees and to convert it into radians and how to do the opposite, how to take an angle measured in radians and convert it into degrees. So, degrees and radians, they both just measure angles, right? It's kind of like degrees Celsius and degrees Fahrenheit. They both measure, measure temperature, but they're just a different way of expressing temperature. So, if we have, let's say, 30 degrees, and we want to convert that into radians, well, if we multiplied 30 by a fraction that was equivalent to 1 over 1, that would be equivalent to multiplying by 1, right? Which wouldn't change the integrity of our question. So we need to come up with a fraction that's equivalent to 1 over 1 that has degrees and radians in it. So, let's think about our unit circle for a sec. If we have an angle that starts out over here and goes halfway around our circle, we say that that's equal to 180 degrees, right? If you want to think of the unit circle in radians, that same measure would be pi radians. So isn't 180 degrees and pi radians the same measure? Yeah, they're the same. So I'm going to multiply by pi radians over 180 degrees. So if I had multiplied by the reciprocal of that, 180 degrees over pi radians, this won't work because we need degrees on the bottom to cancel out degrees on the top of the fraction 30 degrees if you want to put that over 1. They need to cancel out. So when I do this, they'll cancel out because I put it on the bottom. I'll go 30 times pi and that equals 94.247 divided by 180 equals 0 0.523. My degree units cancelled out, so I'm just left with radians. R-A-D. Let's do another one. Let's do 50 degrees is how many radians. We'll multiply by pi radians over 180 degrees. My units of degrees will cancel and I'll just be left with radians, so that's good. And 50 times pi equals about 157 divided by 180 I will get 0 0.87 radians. So, let's talk about if we were going the other way taking something in radians and converting it to degrees. So let's use this one. 0 0.87 radians is how many degrees? I'm going to multiply by the same conversion factor, right? Pi radians is the same as 180 degrees. This time I need the radians to cancel out, not the degrees. So I'll put my pi radians on the bottom so that my units cancel out and I'll put my 180 degrees on the top. I go 0 0.87 times 180 divided by pi equals, I get 50, and the unit is degrees. Which is good because that's what we had over here when we calculated 0 0.87 radians. So the first question we did, we started with 30 degrees and we found that was equal to 0 0.523 radians. Let's try and do the reverse. 0 0.523 radians times radians on the bottom, so it'll cancel out. Pi radians equal 180 degrees, so it'll cancel out. 0 0.523 times 180 divided by pi equals 29.989 degrees. So that's close enough to 30 degrees for me. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, just let me know, and thanks for watching. Bye!